Hello, this is Mr. Ahmed and today we'll do lesson 12.3 Customer Units of Weight Okay, so in the best lesson we studied the customer units of length and today we will do it for weight and our essential question is how can you use models to compare customer units of weight so let's unlock the problem ounces and pounds are customer units of weight how does the size of a pound compare to the size of an ounce okay so here the activity we need color pencils here the number line below shows the relationship between pounds and ounces okay so we will use two different colors first we will use a color pencil to shade the one pound on the number line and up here the one pound and down here this is one ounce so from what we can see here is that the one pound is 16 ounces so you need 16 ounces to make one pound so one pound is 16 times as heavy as one ounce so one pound is 16 ounces so if you want to convert the pounds into ounces you multiply by 16 and here at math talk how can you compare the size of nine pounds to the size of nine ounces okay because of one pound has 16 ounces so it's sure that nine pounds will be greater than the nine ounces the nine ounces are less than one pound here how the number line helped you to compare the sizes of the unit so the number line showed us that there are 16 ounces in one pound so it makes it easy to see that there are 16 ounces in a pound so one pound weighs 16 times as much as one ounce so until now what is important is to know that the pound is 16 ounces if you want to convert pound to ounces you multiply by 16. and now example compare measures nancy needs five pounds of flour to bake pies for a festival she has 90 ounces of flour how can she determine if she has enough flour to bake the pies make a table that relates pounds and ounces okay so we'll make a table to show that the five pounds are how many ounces are they greater than or less than the 90 ounces that she has okay so one pound is 16 ounces we said we multiply by 16 to turn the pounds into ounces so one multiply 16 is 16 ounces two pounds it means two multiply 16 so two multiply 16 two multiply 6 is 12 am i right two down and one up two multiply one is two plus one is three so 32 ounces and three pounds three multiply 16 so 16 multiply three three multiply six is 18 eight down and one up three multiply one is three plus one is four so 48 
ounces and four pounds four multiply 16 16 multiply four four times six is 24 four and up to four multiply one is four plus two is six so 64 ounces and finally five pounds is five multiply 16 so 16 multiply five five multiply six is 30 i write zero down and three up five multiply one is five plus three is eight so 80 ounces so one pound is 16 ounces two pounds are 32 ounces three pounds are 48 ounces four pounds are 64 ounces and five pounds are 80 ounces and she has 90 ounces so here we will compare the 90 ounces to the five pounds which is the are 80 ounces so sure 90 ounces are greater than 80 ounces and she has the 90 ounces so 90 ounces is greater than five pounds so nancy has enough flour to make the pies so as we can see if we want to turn the pounds into ounces you just multiply by 16. and now let's try this here is another thing there are 2000 pounds in one ton make a table that relates tons and pounds so one ton is 2000 pounds so two tons means we double the 2000 it will be 4000 it's like two multiply two is four and i write the three zeros three tons it's three multiply two thousand three multiply two equal six and i write the three zeros so two thousand four thousand six thousand so one ton is two thousand times as heavy as one pound okay so to make them in a chart like the past lesson we can make it like this ton is two thousand pounds and pound is 16 ounces so from ton to pound multiply by 2000 from pound to ounce multiply by 16 and remember if you go the other way from ounce to pound divide by 16 and from pound to ton divide by 2000 okay so let's go for share and show four tons equal how many pounds okay from ton to pound we multiply by 2000 so four tons multiply by 2000 now four multiply two is eight and i write the three zeros so eight thousand pounds so four tons are eight thousand pounds okay here five tons equal how many pounds we'll do the same five multiply tons to pounds tons to pounds multiply by two thousand and five multiply two equals ten and i have to write the three zeros so it's ten thousand here six pounds two ounces okay so from pound to ounce i have to multiply by 16. so i multiply the 6 by 16. 16 multiply 6. 6 multiply 6 is 36 i write 6 down and 3 up 6 multiply 1 is 6 plus 3 it's 9 so 96 ounces so 
what we do here guys if we want to turn the tons into pounds you multiply by 2000 if you want to turn the pound to ounce you multiply by 16. hope you guys understand the lesson and now you solve on your own questions and we will discuss it on the live session if you are in my class have a nice day and goodbye